If you have seen any video on the Pixel 4 launch or even any YouTube review of Pixel 4, you should probably be knowing this feature called Astro Photography. And with this feature, you can actually capture stunning photos of stars and the moon with your mobile. But this feature is only limited to Pixel 4. But you know, whenever Google releases some new feature, always people at XDA developers or someone, they copy the codes, they paste it into all Android devices and we get the Gcam mods, new versions and we get all these features in our smartphones. So this is the time for the OnePlus 7 series or the OnePlus 70 series to get this feature. I have OnePlus 7 with me, I installed it in my mobile, I have also tried it in the OnePlus 7 Pro, it worked perfectly. So in this video, I will show you how to install the Gcam mod and what are the precautions that you should follow while while taking astro photography and also there are some flags that you should enable going into the developer settings so that the astro photography works perfectly i'll show you all of that in this video so let's get this video started before we begin the installation part let me show you the samples between the oneplus nightscape versus the astro photography on the gcam so that you will understand how powerful this astro photography is let's see the samples As you guys saw the samples, now let's jump into the installation part of this Gcam. So first of all, let me open the camera app. This is the camera app. This is the night sight mode. And also, this is the drop down menu which is only available in the 7.0 version of the Google Cam. Let's head on to the settings. And as you guys can see, this is the Gcam version 7.0. Let's go back. Now let's open the file manager. And in the file manager, first of all, you have to create a new folder with Gcam, name Gcam, and G should be capital and C should be capital. And then once you go inside that folder, you have to create one more folder called Confix7. C should be capital here. C O N F I G S 7. So once these two folders are created, go to the downloads. And there you can see a file called H O O L M E F V 7, which I'll provide it in the description down below. You can download it directly from there and then take the file paste it into the same place where you have created a folder I mean in the con inside the config 7 once you have done that that's it close the file manager and then open the camera app give the necessary permissions then click on the dark black area double tap on that and then it will ask you to choose the configure file and then click on restore once you restore all the features, all the settings will be applied to your camera mod. Once you have applied all the necessary settings, click on the night sight and try to take a picture. As you guys can see, it is still taking the normal night sight mode. It is not taking any astro photography. So to activate the astro photography, go to the settings and then go to the developer settings then yeah there are so many settings here and scroll down scroll down scroll down what till you see a mode called night sight or night mode There you go. This is night sight. In this one, you have to enable a feature called 
night sight extended force tripod which is in the first place all these features are actually related to astrophotography only when these features are enabled the night sight mode works if any of these features are disabled the night sight mode will not work I mean night sight or even the astrophotography so now when you click it shows capturing cuttlefish that means it is now trying to capture the complete stars and it will take some time to capture the picture so that it can absorb whatever the light is there and then it can shoot the picture very clearly that's it guys if you guys like this video and if you guys find this video helpful please hit that like button and don't forget to hit that subscribe button because it helps me a lot thank you techie mania signing off